On my on my solo playthrough. Yeah, we're right here. Yeah. And then over here is where you where you go to the uh to the headless from. Like it's right here. This is this is the path to the headless. Okay. Well that's cool. I didn't know that at all. Okay. So we, we, we need to go back to Sinpo Temple. This was an unintended little sidetrack. Not rest, but we will. That was unintentional, but we'll do it. Okay, and then travel. Uh, Sinpo Temple on Mount Congo. Okay, and we're going to go to the... Uh, do, 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 do. We'll go to the Demon Bells Temple. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if that's where we should go, but that's where I'm going. That is where I'm going. And then we can get back from here somehow, I presume. Is there a jump from here to there? I meant to jump. Okay, I that I died before I even got to the tree. I'm pretty sure. So I I don't think that's the way. I don't think the path I was on was the way. Oh, I don't know how to get back from here. I, I, I did a psycho jump to get here, didn't I? There's, there's no, like, reasonable path back from this nonsense. I've got to teleport out. We've got to go to back to the last Bonnie for sure. Yeah. To the Shigendo. I don't know what Shigendo is, but we got to go there. Don't we have a seed? We should, we should find Emma, Emma at some point. Um, after after this upcoming boss, we'll we'll find Emma. Is there anything down here I want? Yeah. I think we're good. I think we're good. You hear that the the chanting again? I don't know where that chanting is coming from. I don't know. Wait, is this where I was? Oh, no, this is the, the boss fight. Okay, it's boss time. This is a Dark Souls boss, literally. It's 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 a reference to Dark Souls, I'm pretty sure. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think it is. Okay, he dunked me. One quick dunking. I mean, there's a trick to fight this guy. Um, he has, like, infinity health. You do have to break his stam. But um, there is another trick to fighting him. You can you can get him to walk out the windows. And it's, it's not, like, cheesy. I'm pretty sure it's intentional. But he's not too tough just doing this. Unless maybe he's immortal and you have to get him to walk out the windows. Maybe Maybe that's it. Maybe that's it. Kidding me? I parried that. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, 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 you have to, you have to, when you, um, when you, when you break him, you just kick him backwards. Okay, so it's not like a secret way to end the fight. It's just how you're supposed to end the fight. It's the only way to end the fight. It's not even how you're supposed to. Okay. Squadra parry, and we're good. There we go. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead? Okay, okay. And he... It's a famous line. It's a very famous line. People love that line. I don't know why, but people do. Breath of Nature Shadow. A latent skill that recovers posture upon performing a death blow. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. I'll take that. I will take that. I will take that. That's good stuff. Okay. Okay. 
So I'm going to go ahead and um, give give him a seed. And we have eight beads. I'll just use four. I'll just use four. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll enhance... I'll, uh, not... There we go. Enhance physical attributes. And then if I feel the need to use four ever again, I will, but... I think we're good. I think we're good for the rest of the game. I think this is this is enough for the uh, the rest of the game. Uh, Kuro's room. Let's go. I like how it's just called Kuro's room. Like he's just, he's just claimed it. It's his now. It's just an old library, but now it's Kuro's room. That was an actual Dark Souls two enemy, was it? I don't I don't remember it. I mean, I, I it's very Souls like, but if that's literally from Souls two, oh, I don't remember it. Um. Oh, and give the dragon rot sample. Okay. Yeah, I've beaten souls, but I don't, I don't, I don't remember that enemy. Okay, we just had two seeds. All right, we're up to seven, seven seeds. That's good. That's good. Um, and then we'll we'll progress a little more. We'll progress a little farther. Back to the game, we progress. Seven seeds is a lot, though. Maybe I'm exaggerating a bit, though. Oh, okay, okay. But it is it is so clearly like supposed to be a souls like boss like it's it's fully armored dude in giant in with giant sword like it's it's so clearly like out of out of tone um like I I'd, I'd be shocked if it's not a souls reference again maybe it's not I don't know I don't know actually but like come on it is just a million and a half dogs you love to see that of course. Everyone's favorite part of all the Souls games, the dogs. Again, I, I always thank you, Miyazaki, for making them die in one hit in this game, at least. They just they just fall over after you hit them once. It makes them much more bearable. It is much less annoying to just hit the dogs once. In Souls, they were always staying alive on one HP. That was, like, the most frustrating thing. Oh, and did the other ones that I that were under the ground? Did they even give me a treasure carp skin? I feel like they didn't. Let's see if there's anything here. Ooh, this is cool. Any any is this good? Holy chapter infested. A holy book on enlightenment inscribed for the divine child of the rejuvenation. For an age, I've been blessed by the worm. To be undying is to walk the eternal path to enlightenment. Thus, I must become enlightened to understand why I cannot die. They said the Holy Dragon's origins were in the West, so I wonder, how did the worm... I shouldn't shake, sorry. I When I shake my legs, I shake the camera. I apologize. How did the worm come to be bestowed upon me? I have no idea. Um, but yeah, the, the infested are like, they're they're coated in worms. I don't, I don't really... I, I can't explain to you why, but they are. Is there something here? Up under there? No, okay. Ooh... No, go go down, go down. That's too far up. A prayer bead. Okay. I like that they hide those. I like that there's some like if you're just if you're searching around, you can get more more health than if you just like zoom in through. I think that's cool. I think that's cool. Free me from the million dudes that just aggroed me. At least they don't have guns here. Oh, that guy has bombs, though, apparently? I spoke too soon. I was like, at least they don't have guns, and then a dude just started blowing me up. I would describe that as worse than guns. Definitely equally or more annoying than being shot. Being hit with a literal bomb? Why am I still being bombed? I didn't notice that dude up there. I didn't know there was another bombsman. Come on, get up there. You can get up there. Oh, isn't there like a million dudes up here too? Oh, okay, not a million, not a million. Just some, just some. What? 
Um, that's the that's what that that thing that just popped out of that human being's body. That is the um, the immortal worm that that we're all so intrigued by. Um, don't kill me. Don't don't take one of my reses. I don't think Kuro has that worm though. I think Kuro's immortality is different than that. I don't think like Sekiro's infested with the worm like like all the other undying are. I think you have a different type of um, immortality, and yours is like um, not good, but less less bad, less like evil. Again, I'm I'm not a hundred percent sure. I'm not a lore aficionado. But I believe that is what is going on. I think Perot has a different type of immortality. But maybe I'm literally wrong. Perot might have just the exact same thing. Okay, I want to double back a little bit. I feel like there's some stuff over here that I, I walk past. The whole area. And again, I don't remember I don't remember this this area perfectly, so. Um, if I'm walking past stuff, there's a chance that I'm like, it's important. Some sugar. Okay, no big deal. Oh, a shield-wielding big dude. Maximum resin. Maximum resin. Can I even break his shield, I wonder? I mean, I don't think that one would have done it, because it was, like, just weird. Stop. He's not really using it as a shield. Uh, it's tough to break if he doesn't actually shield with it. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how you're supposed to kill him. I'm just gonna leave him alone. Those guys get to live for now. I might kill them later. Let me sip. Go down here. Kill this dude. If you're, if you're just my height and you don't have a giant fist, you are, you are, or a giant shield, rather, I am much more happy to fight you. No! Whatever, it's just a res. It's just a res. It's fine. It's fine. Come on. I had that parry timing. Man, I had the timing. I really thought I was going to get out of there. Is it, oh, what the heck? What is... What, who's throwing stuff, bro? Which one of you is throwing stuff at me? Calm down. Oh, it's the monk, the fist monks. They have like they have like a shuriken or something. Yeah, it's something. I don't know what it is. It's something. Don't fall down there. Maybe I do want to go down there actually. Mibu beard of spirit. Mibu beard. Mibu balloon of spirit. I combined the words, my bad. I was like, that didn't sound right. What did you just say? And I was like, beard. Someone who's never seen the word beret before? Hmm? A beard? Okay, okay, okay. I thought that was a two headed dog. It was just two dogs. Slight difference. A regular amount of heads. Just more than one dog. Okay. Tell it. I have him. Might as well use him. Okay. And if I remember correctly, there's a boss in here. Don't burn me. Don't burn me. I'm burning. Whatever, whatever. I think you want to, like, hop and kill all these dudes, and then it spawns a boss, or... Maybe the boss is already... Oh, there he is. He's the big one. He's the big one. Is it just a regular guy? They have, like, a human face? I don't remember what the lore is on these dudes. I remember this boss being, like, incredibly easy. Yeah, his stam is already, like, almost full. I don't think this boss is, like, particularly tough.
Yeah, if you perfect parry that combo like twice, it just dies. So um, let me just kill this thing. We should we should first try this boss. Even we even with no boards. Alright. Yeah, he's almost dead. There we go, there we go. Long arm centipede set on or something. It's gone. It's been taken care of. We got another bead. We got some yellow gunpowder, which is, I presume, like a a rarer uh, upgrade material. I, I genuinely can't quite remember. Okay. Okay. Can I go up there? I don't think... I'll get out of the fire? Okay. I don't think I can go up there. And then that middle hole seems very un unattainable, so I'm just going to leave. Okay, so the, the path here was to get to this boss. All right. I remember the boss, but I did not remember this path being how you got there, so I'm glad I went down this way. Um, I would like to kill every boss in this game, but um, I don't. I might miss one. Um, with with Elden Ring and Souls, we have like backseaters. With uh, Sekiro, there's less familiarity. Well, we have we have one member of the community who knows the game really, really well, but they're on vacation right now, um, so they they're not able to help me out as much. So we might miss a boss during Sekiro. I'll do my best to miss none of them, but, you know, it, it might just happen. Um, I thought I was going in front of me. I thought I was going to that one. I did not mean to yeet myself backwards. What? Okay. Ooh. Oh, just some sugar. What a, what a, what a big, what a roller coaster. Wah? Okay. Ooh. All the emotions. All the emotions all at once. Don't, don't get dunked on by a dude with no with just fists. Okay, okay. And it's another hatsman. I see him. I see him. I see you, hatsman. Oh, it's two hatsmen. If I can drag them apart, that would be way better for me. Oh, there's a third. And the third one is, like, wandering, so. My posture's all bad. Let me sit up straight here. Hopefully the third one doesn't wander over here and fight me. Oh, I, sh I should have rested after fighting that boss. I'm still on zero, zero gourds. Yeah, whatever. We might, we might die to this dude. This dude might kill us. With, with no heals, this is a, a touch rough. I'll use my last pellet. See, he doesn't like one shot. No. Dang it, I died. I was trying to parry it. Whatever. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, I'm, I'm messed up on the second monitor. Real quick here. Give me my mouse. Whatever, it stole it away. I'll just leave it messed up. Who cares? It's fine. It doesn't affect anything, so it's fine. Oh, we had 1300 bucks too. Where'd we get all the money from? Okay, this this will be a quick run back this time. It was really slow, but that's because I was exploring. The the actual run back to the temple won't take that long. Do I even need to go up there? This looks fine. And I will I'll go back to Kotaro. Um I will I will uh give him the white flower. The the white the white petal. I don't remember what it does. Um I think maybe he gives you a, a golden fan or something. That if you kill enemies, they give you more money. I can't remember. Um, I, th I think that's what happens. It gives you, like, a, a special fan that you can use to spirit away someone. Um, to be spirited away, for anyone wondering. Um, which is, like, the, of course, the famous movie Spirited Away. Is when, um, you were taken to the, the spirit realm. Like, the, the, um, the divine realm. Um, and, and certain people, through certain practices, are said to be able to do that. I'm just gonna avoid the sword dudes for now. If I can, I might as well. I assume I'm going to have to fight them eventually. Maybe not. Because I don't want it. That sucked. That was me playing really poorly. If I could ever hit this guy, that would be great. He parries, like, everything. I just jumped. I jumped off the edge. Well, I dodged his attack, I guess. I dodged the... What do you want me to do? I dodged the attack. I didn't get hit. Wait, wait, wait. Let me sip. Let me sip. I have seven sips now. There was a tree here, too. Give me the tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
then where could I jump to from here? There was another jump point, I feel like. Like, it showed me one, for sure. I, I swear it showed me one. Oh, it's just right there. Okay. That's the world's weirdest jumping point, but okay. I'll take it. I'm inside the temple. I'm inside the temple. I think there's a Bonnie in here. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong, but I think there's a Bonnie in here. Yeah, there is. Let's go. Oh, let me rest so I can, like, reset. Okay. And then there's also an item in here, if I remember correctly. Like, there's a... Yeah, yeah, there we go. It's just up here. It's, it's easy to get to. I thought it was hard to get to. Oh, there's another item back there. Dragon blood droplet. Oh, I think that's the thing that cures the dragon rot. And lump of fat wax, which I I have no need for. Oh, man, those dudes are kind of freaky. I think this is the door with... No, it doesn't open from this side. You open it from the outside? That's rare. I think that's the door with the two samurai. So sugar. Or maybe this is the door with the two samurai? I wonder where that other door is. Like, what it, where it's coming from or whatever. Yeah, there's, there's the samurai. Let me... Just rest. Just rest. Rest. Please leave me alone, samurai people. I don't want to fight you. You have giant hats and you're spooky. Okay. I think there was a path. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is this is this must be something. This must go somewhere. I'm not sure where, but it must go somewhere. Hopefully not just in a circle, back to somewhere I've already been. I guess these are all like ancient monks, like monks that are venerated, statues of them at least. And I wanna know what's up with these people. Like the people with the worms in them, I'm like, sure, I get it. They're the worm people. They, they're, they're immortal because of the worms. But what are these dudes? Why are they all like this? It's not worms coming out of them, is it? No, it's like it's like metal like claws. Not on their hands, of course, but like on their back and stuff. So I, I don't know what's up with those dudes. They're they're kind of weird with it. Mm, didn't mean to fall. I think I'm gonna fight a headless. If I had to guess, I'm gonna assume there's a headless up here somewhere. Ooh, that was kind of slick. Oh, and wait, is his back's out? Yeah, I don't, I don't know what all that stuff is. I don't, I'm very confused by it. Is this where I just was? Did I just run a lap? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I just ran a lap. Okay, 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 okay. Well, let me just go all the way up and make sure. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 Okay. So I have to go down? Somewhere? Like, there there must be another another path down there. So I went up, I went down, and then just immediately back up. You must be able to go down more? Okay, yeah, yeah. And I'm assuming there's, like, a, a Shemin warrior or a headless and when you're in these spooky areas where like the the edge of the map or the edge of the screen is all like like faded in um you have like the fish eye at the edge that that, that you normally fight like in undead is this what the surgeon was wearing the like uh the white gear is that surgeon drip don't burn me no i'm burning whatever I will just get the death flows and heal up whatever health I lose from the burn. Is this one dead too? This guy's dead too? I don't know what's up with all these people. Where am I? Was this where you get the Sabi Maru? This might be where you get Sabi Maru. No, Sinpu Esoteric Text. Oh, this is where you learn the Sinpu style. If you want to, if you want to do the punches, you can. 
Um, like the punch attacks. You, you, you can do them. Okay, and then I saw that's the... This is where we fart... Fart, excuse me. This is where we fought Robert. Um, and that's where we went. So I'm gonna hope that this is a new area. Like when I sling across here. Oh! This, I just ran like a big lap just now. So how do I progress this area? I've been I've been a little confused all day. I couldn't find the monkeys. I don't know how to progress this area. We've we've hit the confusing part of the game. It seems. I don't think it's supposed to be the confusing part of the game, but for me it definitely is. Um. Maybe you don't progress this area. In, in what might sound insane, maybe this area has no further... I, I think maybe you just leave. I think I think you do your business here and then just leave. Is this going to kill me? Okay. I thought I could just jump down. You can, you can jump really far. I thought I could make it. Um, and I'm actually trying to die. I want to go back to the Bonnie so I can go to uh, another the other Bonnie. Um, I want to go back to Kotaro. Kot 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 Kotaro? Kotaro? I don't know. It's five o'clock. We'll go to Kotaro and then um, we're gonna close it up. I didn't realize the time. I just looked over and I was like, I haven't looked at the time in a while. I should check. But it is five. I we just spent two hours looking for monkeys today and we never found them. Sorry about that. Monkey Madness Three did not just drop. I lied. I I completely lied. There's monkeys here too. At, at oh wait, is there monkeys here? Is this where you do the monkey fight? But I, I don't know. I think this there might be a monkey fight here I need to do later. But for now, I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Let's get off the tree. Okay, so I'm going to give him the white flower that he's asking for. I don't know what happens if you give him the red and white one, but I don't want to see. I'm just he, Why mess with him? He's, he's, he's going through a rough time. Oh, Yep, yep, they drank the water. Oh, yeah, so he um, so yeah, I have to get the golden feather and come back to him. Or the golden fan, excuse me. I don't think it's a feather. Um, I thought I thought I would spirit him away and he would give me the fan. I don't remember how that works. Okay, we'll get this place figured it out. We'll get this place figured out. Um, today was confusing, but we, we beat Oren, yo. Uh, today was a successful day. If we beat Oren, that's a successful day in my book. Alright, we'll stare at Sekiro. We'll do the outro. Alright, y'all. If you were here for a moment, if you were here for an hour, or if you were here for the whole stream, thank you, and it means so much. Truly, thank you. Okay. I'm going to be back tomorrow at 9 a.m. Central. Yeah, big success. Thank you for saying so. Thank you for saying so. Um, so I'll be back 9 a.m. Central tomorrow. I sure hope to see you all then. Until I see you again, be safe and have a lovely night. Bye now. Hey, everybody. Quist Gaming here. If you're enjoying the content, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. It truly makes a difference. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.